case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2000, the New York Court of Appeals heard the case of Beyondy v. Beekman Hill House Apartment Corp., which questioned whether corporations should be allowed to indemnify directors for legal fees and settlements if they behaved well or not if they behaved badly. Former president of Beekman Hill House Apartment Corporation Board of Directors, Nicholas Biondi, faced a lawsuit for denying a sublease application of an African-American couple based on their race. A trial jury found Biondi violated federal and state civil rights laws and retaliated against a shareholder for opposing the denial, awarding compensatory and punitive damages. The court ruled that Beekman could not indemnify Biondi for the punitive damages as he acted in bad faith. Upholding the ruling, the appellate court stated that public policy prohibits indemnifying a director for punitive damages resulting from violating civil rights laws and retaliation. The court held that Biondi's actions, which violated public policy, were in bad faith, making him ineligible for indemnification under the business corporation law, which permits indemnification only if a director acted in good faith and in the corporation's best interests. Thus, the appellate division's order was affirmed with costs. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSD.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.